Hi guys, welcome to this video. In this video, I'm going to show you how to make a Captain America shield out of cardboard. You don't believe me? Look! It's fragile. Welcome to my new content. I call it Make It Cheap. Actually, this content is inspired from the Hacksmith, Make It Real, where they made cool stuff from movies or video games to real life. But of course, in my version, I'm going to make it um, low budget. I just want to make sure that everyone can make it. When the hacks made make it real, I make it cheap. So, welcome to the first episode of Make It Cheap. Firstly, we're gonna need to make sharp triangles on the cardboard. Um, this cardboard was my bike package box. As you can see, there are many dents on it, but it's fine. I still can use it. We need to make 20 to 21 pieces of it to make a circle. It's gonna take time on this part with limited tools like this. I wish I have laser cut but home tools still work and the most important, it's cheap. Very cheap. Now bend the cardboard a little bit to make a shield shape and glue all the triangles together. I just use hot glue on this part. When all the triangles glued together, it's probably not gonna fit perfectly. Just like this, I need to cut this part to make the shield perfectly circle. You can put a roll of tape or anything you have, then put the shield on it. Now. Put some things on every edge of the shield to keep it steady. If you wonder what it is, it is a hand iron. My grandfather heritage from World War II. I need to apply wood glue on the shield to make it steady. Or you can use resin. But the wood glue is the only thing I got. It works the same. Apply the glue all over the shield. The glue that I use is pretty cheap. I got it about a dollar. You can use uh, wood glue or paper glue. This glue is working for wood or paper. Because this is a wet glue, we need to wait more or less 12 hours until it's perfectly dry. The next day, I measured the diameter of the shield and it was exceeded the actual size of the cap shield. I need to cut it a bit. The diameter of Captain America's shield is about 25 inches. step is to make the rings. I need to draw the rings and the star to see how the shell is going to look like. I made the rings out of hard foam. Hey, you shared a shell made of cardboard! Okay, okay, the shield is actually made of cardboard and foam, but the main part of it is cardboard, so it's a cardboard shield, okay? The width of the ring is about 20.6 inches, so you need to cut the foam very carefully to make a perfect circle. the star, I printed a pentagon so we can make a perfect star on the phone. I 
I made a bit of lines on this star to make it looks more elegant. You can add it or not. I found the template on Google and it looks pretty good. And now we can glue all the foam on the cardboard. Starting from the star, just do it slowly to make it tidy. And I still use wood glue on this part. Well, because it's a handmade, the result isn't that perfect. There are many gaps between the rings. This happens if you don't cut the foam properly, but it's okay. Now it's time to paint the shield. Before you apply the paint, make sure the surface of the shield is clean and no dust. For the primary color, I use white wall paint. It's supposed to be primary gray, but this is the only paint that I got from my stockroom. After the paint perfectly dry, sand it a little bit before applying the spray paint and I'm going to color the blue part first. So we need to mask the star with the masking tape. Don't forget to cover the rings and make sure there is no gap. This paint is metallic blue curacao. It's pretty good. Okay, now let's spray the red rings. Because I sanded the primary paint too hard, I just peeled off the paint and I need to repaint it again before applying the silver color. Now for the shield strap, I'm gonna use my old belt, the weapon of every parent in the world. Just glue the belt with hot glue on the shield. I added self-adhesive hook and loop on one of these straps, so it can be adjustable. To make it stronger, I put a bit of wood glue on every side of the belt. Okay, as you can see, uh, the gap between the rings isn't that noticeable. And thanks to Sean Square for the idea of making the shield out of cover. If you want to see his shield version, you can uh, find a link in the description to his channel. And you also will find a link where you can download the template so you can build your own shield. Alright guys, thanks for watching this video. I hope you like this video. Please leave a like if you like this video. Subscribe to see my next project in the future. And I'll see you on the next episode of Make It Cheap. As always, stay creative. Oh.